Welcome back everyone, Genshin Impact has been out for a while so let's do some gameplay on my Samsung Galaxy S21 and kind of see how it runs. Now this is not a full in-depth tutorial or anything and I'm fairly new to this game to be honest but I just wanted to showcase some of the graphics. Now right out the gate I do want to tell you this is a 120 hertz you know phone so in some cases some of the 120 hertz you know capability should be there. It looks like it's still at 60 hertz but the 120 hertz still is very good. Now you can see the graphics load up very very well. I don't know which setting I'm specifically on right now but you can kind of tell that you know everything works exactly as I expected. I have an iPhone 13 as well and it does seem like it's about the same you know capability. It seems like everything's loading fine but look at the graphics you know in terms of the water and everything. Everything looks pretty much as expected as before. You can see some of the shading going on in the water as well it looks really good. If I go ahead and you know kind of do some you know simple moves like this seems like everything's pretty much you know as normally as expected a little glitch right there totally okay though so let's kind of go through here jumping seems fine as well and like i mentioned the main thing i want to showcase is just how this gameplay is you can see shadows look really really well it's kind of loading out in the background some glitches here and there it's definitely not a big deal but it is something i'm kind of seeing but it's totally okay you know whenever you have you know a game like this it's not going to be you know the best performing game of all time on every single device it is a very very heavy game this game is very very massive you can see even right here it still actually looks pretty good if we go ahead and zoom in for example you can see it seems to be loading up fairly well you can see the grass right here everything looks to be fairly well the water looks you know pretty good as well. I don't know how many different words I can use. If I go and zoom out all the way, kind of just keep zooming out and see how far we can go. I mean, it does seem like everything is as expected. You know, it is a little glitchy. It's probably smoother on like actual consoles, but it looks fairly good for the most part. And I'm not really complaining about it too much. Now, if we make our way back to where we're supposed to go. So if we make our way over here, you can see everything's loading. Like I mentioned, as expected, it's not in a slow performing device by any means. It seems to be going as pretty much exactly as I was expecting it to go, which is always really good. You don't want a phone that's going to be like extremely slow or anything like that. And, you know, I'm sure if you're somebody who wants to just, you know, have a device who can play this game, I can see you perfectly playing this game perfectly fine on this type of device. It is not a slow performing phone by any means. And you can even see from everything that I've done so far, it's pretty good. Now, what would I rate it? I would probably say it's up there. Maybe like a, I don't want to say it's like a, like a 15 out of 10. It's somewhere more like a, you know, like a, I don't know how to describe it. I would say it's probably like an eight out of 10, maybe like a, it's probably like an eight and a half out of 10, you know, something along those lines. And the reason I say that is because there are some glitches here and there. And like I mentioned, when you have a device like the Samsung Galaxy S21, I mean, this thing is going to be a very performance heavy machine. This thing is really going to be able to, you know, handle anything you throw at it. It's definitely not going to be perfect, but for the most part for, you know, just the graphics within the first couple minutes of this game, it seems like, you know, if you're somebody who wants to play this game and kind of move on with your life, this is a very very decent device to do that on. So that pretty much covers up a little gameplay of Genshin Impact on the Galaxy S21. If you guys have any other questions or anything, let me know in the comment section as well. Hit the like button, not me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.